Bilal Muhammad is the best welterweight on the planet right now. And it's not really even that close. Bilal Muhammad is on a 9 fight win streak. And he's one of the most active welterweights as well. He broke and destroyed Sean Brady's undefeated record. Now, I already know what you're thinking. But Bilal, he's so boring. You're just a casual. Anyone who actually knows anything about MMA would look at Bilal Muhammad and see a very intelligent fighter with amazing game plans who just knows how to win. Now, I understand why he gets a lot of hate. I mean, he just keeps beating fan favorite fighters in dominant fashion. He absolutely ran through Gilbert Burns while Hamzat Shemaev struggled. And I know there's other people out there saying, But, but, but against Leon Edwards, he, he wasn't looking that good. Listen, bro, you didn't let Bilal Muhammad cook. And the dirty fighter, Leon Edwards, poked him in the eye because he knew that was about to come down his throat and take what's his. I am absolutely sick of this Bilal Muhammad slander. L listen, listen, listen. When he becomes UFC welterweight champion, what are you guys going to say then? What are you guys going to say then? Please, comment down below what are you going to say. When Bilal Muhammad is the UFC world welterweight champion. Bilal Muhammad would run through, walk down, and finish Kamara Usman. And he would beat Leon Edwards in a dominant, dominant decision. And absolutely take his soul. And then there's gonna be other people that say, Well, against Gilbert Burns, um, Gilbert had a broken arm. Yeah, he had a broken arm because Bilal Muhammad f***ing broke it! And it really just kind of angers me because all these MMA fans are out there like, I just want a respectable guy who's in the UFC, you know, who's real respectable, gets these wins, real stand-up guy. Bala Muhammad is one of the most stand-up guys in the UFC. He's not hitting pregnant women with his car. He's not doing cocaine. He's not doing anything bad at all. He's a great guy and a great role model, and he would be an amazing champion. And he's an active fighter. Sure, his fights aren't brutal wars, but he wins them. That's what the fighter is supposed to do, is win the fights. What, do you want to be like Nate Diaz and have double digit losses? No! Hey, 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 all you haters out, all you haters out there, I want you to remember the name. Say his name. What's his name? It's Bilal. He has good boxing, good kickboxing, good BJJ, good wrestling, good Muay Thai, good cardio, good everything! Okay, calm down. Okay, listen, I'm just really passionate about this. I'm sorry. I just hate seeing people who work so hard, who try so hard to be great, who work really, 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 really hard, who win their fights, who are, they're doing everything right. It's just unfair. So this is my plea to you. Next time Bilal Muhammad fights, don't make fun of him. Don't complain. If you really don't like his style that much, just don't watch his fight. But I hope you have a little bit more appreciation for Bilal Muhammad because he's a great fighter and he's a great guy and i really think he deserves way more respect please like comment and subscribe if you support Bilal muhammad i hope you have a great rest of your day peace be upon you